Hi, I'm Tim. Welcome to Watchbox, and thanks for logging on. If you love this watch, email me, tmosso at thewatchbox.com. It's in the description below. Your purchase and pricing email question line for buying this or any watch you see on any Watchbox platform. Please reach out to me directly. Email tmosso at thewatchbox.com for pricing. Today, we're discussing a watch that was launched in 2016, as you see it here. Launched just one year after the Harmony collection as a whole, this is the Vacheron Constantin Harmony Monopusher Pulsometer Chronograph. The watch in rose gold is tonneau-shaped and 42 millimeters in diameter. It is 13.3 millimeters thick from lug tip to lug tip, 51.8 millimeters with a broad and modern 24 millimeter spacing between the lugs. My wrist is 16 centimeters in circumference, and you can see this watch pushes out right to the edge. So I would consider this to wear like a 43 or a 44 millimeter round watch. In tech and spec, it's a more traditionally inspired alternative to some something like a tonneau shaped Richard meal, but it's got an immense amount of wrist presence and the horology inside to match. Just keep in mind, you need a wrist of my size, 16 centimeters circumference or larger. Probably will fit underneath the cuff, but big watch. Now the strap, medium rectangular scale alligator leather on the bottom, dark brown large rectangular scale alligator leather on the top, dark brown, monotone stitch, sheer cut side. The point of gator on both sides is to create a hardier and longer wearing, more durable strap. A bit more expensive, but on a watch like this, worth it. The lugs are drilled close to the case, and then a curved spring bar is used so that there is no impingement, no impediment to the motion of the strap. It can pull straight down out of the lugs. Take a quick look at the buckle, double folding clasp and rose gold to match the case. We have a little Maltese cross motif inside and out. And take note, a screw on the underside that is used to fix the buckle into whichever strap hole you choose. So once you have it sized, you have even more protection against accidentally dropping your watch than you would with a deployment clasp by itself. Now this watch inspired by a model from 1928, clearly of a pre-Art Deco persuasion. The Exposition des Arts Décoratifs, I believe, was 1925. And while this is technically part of the Art Deco era, 1928 was very much internationally still of a prior sensibility. So there are a lot of elements here that are maybe proto-Art Deco, but also Art Nouveau. And it's a lovely organic form. You can see the case has integrated lugs, a broad, bosomy, full, volume to it. It is a generous size for a watch inspired by the 1920s. That is modernity's contribution. Modernity contributing the size and the standard finish. Antiquity contributing a lot of the details like the dial, the hands, and the shape of the case. Mono pusher chronograph. You can see that the pusher is coaxial with the crown. You also see that the watch is somewhat layered with the bezel sitting atop the cushion case. And then we have a dial that is a sort of opaline silver, so it's not a directional grain like a sunburst. It's a frosted matte, softly glowing color. Now we had a blue accented set of numerals and tracks for 2015 for the anniversary watch. And then this model with black uh, scales and individual Arabic numerals. This came out in 2016. It's very easy to confuse this with the 2015 watch. This is the 2016 model. We have a couple of different colors. We have rose gold for the spade style hour hand, the Esagai style minute hand, black for the primary scales as well as the numerals and the chronograph minutes and chronograph seconds hand, and then red for the pulsometric track outboard. You can see that the chronograph minutes scale is on a 45 minute basis. So this is a little bit different from most chronographs, which only have a 30-minute counter. Great if you are a European football fan. We have a little power reserve indicator down at the base of the dial. It's kind of binary between 1 and 0, but unlike quantum physics, you can actually be in a state between the two, and that depends on where you are in the watch's manual wind 65-hour power reserve. Okay, the pulsometer scale. What you do is you start the chronograph while holding your patient's pulse, and when you count 30 pulses, you stop the chronograph. It's very similar to a tachymeter or a telemeter. And you can see when I stop it right here, for example, 
Well, if I counted 30 pulses and stopped it at that point, we would be at 100 and approximately 175 to 180 beats. So it's a very simple system for gauging the pulse in 30 pulsations. Turning it all over, you can see the caliber is modern, though inspired by the old Lamagna 2310, which is still used in some applications by Vacheron. This is the more modern and fully in-house 3301. So you can see it is large and sized to suit the case back of this enormous dress watch. It is a manual wind with a 65-hour reserve. You can see it's modern in its use of a free-sprung regulator, five-position adjusted, which is the chronometer and high horology standard. You can see there's an overcoil hairspring, so in pretty much any position, the hairspring will breathe concentrically. And of course, uh, the watch has a relatively vintage beat rate. It's not 18K like a Lamagna. It's 21,600 vibrations per hour. Note the use of a black-polished Maltese cross at the center of the collar wheel. The cross is actually stationary and the crenellations revolve around it. An unusual application of a column wheel and a lateral clutch. First of all, it is column wheel and lateral clutch. And yes, the feel is outstanding and the sound matches. You can also appreciate that the watch is beautifully finished. Geneva hallmark on the movement and yes, Geneva hallmark on the case. As since mid-2012, it has been a whole watch standard finish. Now take a look at the most unconventional element. If you regard the lateral clutch and underneath my finger, you can see there are two coaxial wheels. So this intermediate driving wheel for the chronograph has a gold colored wheel atop a, a conventional steel Maltese cross motif wheel. And if you look, you can see they're coaxial and they're superimposed. And the reason for this is that the upper gold wheel is being driven by a wheel that is connected to the fourth wheel of the movement. So that's your uh, chronograph clutch primary driving wheel, and it's driving this wheel on top. The wheel on the bottom has a much, much finer tooth profile, and it is in contact with the chronograph center wheel. So you can see the disparity in the tooth spacing between those two wheels. The one on the bottom has the finer teeth. As a result, the coupling is always between the fine-toothed wheels. As a result, you get the beauty of a lateral clutch, but when you start, there's none of the jump that you get with a lateral clutch. It starts as smooth as a vertical clutch, and that's why you have those two superimposed wheels on the chronograph clutch, one with a coarse tooth profile and one with a fine fine tooth profile. Everything you would expect. The steel components satinated on their top, beveled on their side. We have abundant black polish on the column wheel, the Maltese cross. You could see it on the cap of the regulator and then all of the screw heads. The screw heads feature chamfered slots, chamfered circumference. We have beautiful decoration on the rhodium plated brass bridges. You could see that they have a gorgeous unglage in their own right. And then we have one beautiful sharp interior angle where the bevels of the escape wheel cock meet. It is a beautifully rendered Vacheron in-house caliber. And if you look carefully, you can see beautiful beveled outward points. Inward points are nice, but so too are outward points where two bevels meet and come to a sharp outward blade-like point. And this watch has that, again, 30 meters water resistant. It's a sporty dress watch, not a true sports watch, but it has a lot going on. Reach out to tmasso at thewatchbox.com for purchase and pricing details.